Twigger, where's your twigs? The twigs are taking the rest. Seem like my life been really changing on me. I know some niggas out here hating on me. Hey, I see the bitches how they changing on me. I know some niggas out here snaking on me. Hey, see like my But shit, what's the damn deal, people? Shit, look, your boy's here. I'm just gonna hang get to it. We're gonna get to burden white privilege. Everybody's probably like, Twigga, where's your twigs? The twigs are taking the rest, okay? I just wanna let the beard breathe. I got it all straight now, looking all pretty, a little nice, you know what I'm saying? I'm looking thick. If the wind was blowing, my shit just be like this, waving at people, like, hey, how y'all doing? You know what I'm saying? My shit looking beautiful as shit right now. So I just wanna let it just blow in the wind, you know what I'm saying? But shit, anyways, burden, white privilege, oh my jeez. What's finna happen in this video? I know a lot of shit's finna happen. I don't know what I'ma say. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know who's finna come in. But a lot of y'all in the comments need to calm down because y'all doing a lot of shit talking. And a lot of y'all probably can't even back up. You know what I'm saying? Because the shit's getting annoying. I'm starting to get annoying. You know what I'm saying? I ain't letting it bother me shit, but it's getting a little annoying. I'm gonna slap shit out of a couple of y'all. I've been talking all that shit, man, but it's cool. I am not tripping. But, anyways, why? Let's talk about something. And why do y'all believe? No, I didn't nobody. Who is white? Believe that I ain't gonna say nobody, but why do a lot of people believe? I can't even talk. Why do a lot of white people believe that there is not white privilege? Answer me that question because I said something about it last time in video. All white people says ah 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 going crazy and shit. Like no white people, we don't have to go and argue. We can actually have a fucking civil conversation. Just talk. Comment down below. Let me know. Twigger, this is what it is. This is why I believe we don't have white privilege. This is why I do believe we do have white privilege because there is such thing as white privilege. Then I had somebody say, well, there's such thing as a black privilege. How? What? Tell me. You know what I'm saying? Tell me what it is to have a black privilege. What is black privilege? To be able to do what? To get killed? Get shot all the time? Get beat up? Get thrown in jail all the time? Then you're gonna say, well, stop running from the cops. Stop doing this. A lot of shit doesn't, a lot of that does not even happen. And we still get killed. But nobody cares. It's because it's always gonna be an excuse to sit here and say, well, this happens because of this and this and this and that. It's never gonna be just what it is. We never look at shit just for what it really is. No. Well, this is the reason why it happened. Man, come on, man. Everybody's opinion don't mean shit. Mine's don't mean shit sometimes to a lot of y'all. But it means something to me. You know what I mean? I wouldn't be on this platform trying to just say bullshit and everything else and make myself look dumb. No! Twigger ain't trying to look dumb. Twigger's trying to look sophisticated and nice. And my beard look nice, blowing the wind, saying, hey. But anyways, enough of this funny shit. Let's get into it, man. Burden. White privilege. Come on, white people. Let's see what happens. And maybe he on my side. Let's see. News breaking. Thank you, Diane. And in today's news, <laughs> let's talk about this white privilege. Huh. I'm about to stir up the pot. I'm going to talk about what they don't want me to say. This division of race is a spit in the face of America. Look at how far when it came. Huh. Oh, what a shame. How does the media fill us with hate? How do you feel like it's racist for someone to say that they're keeping America blame? Hey, man. Okay, let's get into it. He's really spitting the shit on this one. I'm going to go ahead and restart it from the beginning because I want to hear it again. So I can really speak on it and be like, hey, I already know what I'm talking about. So let's start it from the beginning. Let's start. So everybody like, hey, you know what he said. Let's do it again then. Thank you, Diane. And in today's news, <laughs> let's talk about this white privilege. I'm about to stir up the pot. I'm going to talk about what they don't want me to say. This division of race is a spit in the face of America. Look at how far when it came. Hey. Oh, what a shame. How does the media fill us with hate? How do you feel like it's racist for someone to say that they're keeping America blame? Okay. Yeah, he's spinning this shit. How does it feel? This, damn, that shit. The last part throws me off every time I fucking hear it. The last part throws me off. Let the media fill us with hate. How do you feel like it's racist for someone to say that they're keeping America blame? Okay, how do we feel like it's racist for someone to say they're keeping America great? First of all, let's see. Is America great? A lot of people will say yes. A lot of people who is not black will say yes. You find have might have a few black people who say America is great or whatever, but hey, that's just what their opinion. You know what I'm saying? America is great in certain aspects, certain times, certain things, certain this. Okay, but it's not great for us, black people. It has never been great for us. Whatever your comments are gonna blow up. Ah, whatever, black guy. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a lot of shit. But I'm just being honest to say it's not. There's there ain't shit for us in America as being black. You know what I'm saying? It's really not. The only thing is we're fucking animals. We're, we're fucking looked at as scum the worst shit on earth we're fucking looked at as this and i'm not trying to make it a black and white thing i'm just saying in general this is what it is but it's what he talking about is like 
There's such thing as a white privilege, man. There really is, but white people's not gonna say it. Let's see. Let's talk about this white privilege. I'll make it clear so that y'all get this. I ain't never had an opportunity in life that was given base for the tone of my skin is. You ain't depressed. Look at what year it is. There ain't no talking to you. You ain't hearing this. He just the cracker who walk around talking this shit. He politically wrong and he's arrogant, right? Fist in the air, black pride, that's great. But if I do the same for my race, that's hate. You can do what he wants, is what a lot of you say. But if I play with the police, I'ma have a bad day. So you must be high. Then already told you I don't wanna die. Who said it was better? Okay, so, how can we put this? How can I put this? White privilege, he's saying that it doesn't work. He's saying that it's not his skin tone and his way he is or whatever has never given him an opportunity to do shit. First of all, my nigga, you got tattoos I love, so of course. Of course not, my nigga. You got tattoos from neck down, bro. You know what I'm saying? White privilege works for the, 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 the diddy white people who are fucking so crazy. I talked to a chick, man, you know what I'm saying, right now. Who says, yeah, there is such thing as a white privilege. I use it to my advantage all the time. And she's white. You know what I'm saying? She uses it to her advantage all the fucking time. She acts so dumb. And we have great conversations. She's not dumb at all. But she'll act dumb just to get shit by because she can do it. Now, of course not, bro. My nigga, you don't look like you sitting here and you came from a good home and everything. You probably lived in the hood or whatever the fuck. So, of course, you're not going to get the motherfucking white privilege, bro. Only certain white people get certain white privilege. I don't think a lot of people understand that. Ain't nobody saying that all white people get white privilege because y'all don't. A lot of y'all, they get treated just like niggas do, just like Mexicans do, just like Asians do. We get treated bad, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of y'all white people get treated bad like that, too. But y'all not understanding, man. It's like it doesn't work for all white people. Certain white people who fit a certain criteria uses that white privilege. Am I wrong? You're going to tell me I'm wrong. I don't care though, cause I'm not wrong in my eyes. They told you a lie. You think that my color don't help you survive? I don't despise my hair in my eyes. My heritage made me as handsome as I. Don't make me no better, no worse than no other person. Just saying, I'm happily white. It must be the same. Let me explain. Work the same jobs and we get the same pay. Wanna pass school? Had to get the same grades. If you make the same choices, you get the same places. Let me speak. Like I said, bro, it works for certain people. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't work for everybody. It doesn't work for every single one of you guys. But let's hear that part again for people like, you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't. Let me explain. Work the same jobs and we get the same pay. Want to pass school, had to get the same grades. If you make the same choices, you get the same places. Let me speak. Okay, okay, white privilege, man. Why do y'all believe that there's not one? Like, honestly, like I said, bro, you got tattoos all over your fucking body. You got, you don't look like the typical white dude. So, of course not. You know what I'm saying? If you didn't have all that, you talked a certain different way and this and this and that, I'm guaranteed, bro, you would get away with a lot of different shit. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to believe me because you're just going to believe what you believe in. It's like, I'm going to believe what I believe But I'm going to believe in what is the truth at things. You know what I'm saying? From what I see, from what I've been through. You know what I'm saying? If me and you both, or if you, not not me and you both, because me and you both get pulled over, my nigga, you just as black as I am, because you damn near look black with all the shit you got on you, trying to be something, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, let's get it to it. Let's talk about this white privilege. Let's talk about this white privilege. It don't exist, God is my witness. Uh, it's it don't exist, yes, it I don't get it, because I don't agree. Like I didn't make it up out of the street, with nowhere to sleep and nothing to eat. Everything that we do by choice, your racist move and ain't mute my voice, my life in hell as far as I can tell the idea. So let's ask the question, bro, because we don't know you, you know what I'm saying? We don't know your story. Well, I don't, should I say. How were you born, you know what I'm saying, as far as, like, what you had to grow up and go through? What your parents was like? What kind of home was you in, you know what I'm saying? What, what, what made you who you are? What made you start rapping? What made you do all the tattoos? What made you do all this? There's a story behind it, you know what I'm saying? So now that you made this video, you're going to have a lot of white people who don't believe this, don't believe that, or you're going to start thinking a lot of different shit. But when it comes down to it, my nigga, it really is a white privilege whether you believe it or not. You don't have to believe it. We know it. I'm from outside looking in. It's always white people to tell you how black people are supposed to feel. It's always white people to tell you that there ain't a white privilege. It's always white people who wants to sit there and reply about shit that don't even really fucking matter when it comes to Trump, when it comes to all this other shit. Like, it's always the white people to do that. Are y'all feeling guilty or something? Because it's only y'all who's really saying shit, you know what I'm saying? And you got a lot of these motherfucking internet gangsters talking all this shit and everything else and whatever. That's a whole nother story. But I'm just saying, 
At the end of the day, we all fucking know that it does exist, whether you want to believe it or not. And I'm sticking to it. Hate me or not, it is the truth. Wanted to rap, I'm a man that I can't. I can't resolve the inequality yet. I applied for jobs, they ain't calling me yet. My eyes are green and my skin is white. Maybe they've been busy, yeah, that's gotta be it. You probably believe it. Now you gotta get even. Uh, even though I ain't seen it, that ain't the way that I'm treated. Telling me you got expectations of me paying you reparations. But all the voice of a million people feel the same exact way of praying to say they right. right. I'm about to stir up the pot, I'm gonna talk about what they don't. You are gonna stir up the pot. You are gonna talk about what people don't want you to do. But let's go back and get Get his wife, maybe they've been busy. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Be a job, they ain't calling me yet. My eyes are green and my skin is white. Maybe they've been busy. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Be you probably believe it. Now you gotta get even. Even though I ain't seen it, that ain't the way that I'm treated. Telling me you got expectations of me paying you reparations. But all the voice of a million people feel the same exact way of praying to say they right. right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I don't know, bro. I don't know. It's hard to say a lot of shit because yeah, it's just not gonna. It's not gonna matter. At the end of the day, when it comes to white and black, when it comes to all the shit that we're going through, when it comes to what we believe in, what y'all believe in, it is never gonna fucking matter. We're never gonna come together. Can we just admit that? You know what I'm saying? Can we all just admit that we are never going to come together? That we don't give a fuck about the next person. I'm not saying me. I'm just saying as a whole in general. Can we just all say we not finna fucking care. We not finna get rid of racism. We not finna get rid of nothing. Because we all can't see what the fuck the truth is at hand. That's laid out into us. You know what I'm saying? Everybody wants to say, well, white people get killed just as much as black people. And all this other shit, I understand that. But it is totally different. Well, how is it different, John? Look at how we are getting killed. Look at why we are getting killed. You know what I'm saying? You motherfuckers just gets to sit there and shoot at cops. And take off fucking running and do all this shit and live, nigga. We fucking just stand there doing shit and die, my nigga. So it's not the same shit, bro. When we say Black Lives Matter, just because I say Black Lives Matter doesn't mean I'm with the movement, nigga. Or doesn't mean I'm not with the movement. It just means that I believe that as my skin color matters. That's all the fuck we're saying. But no, we're going to get all live matters. We're going to get white live matters. We're going to get all this other shit. Because nobody wants to fucking sit here and really look at life for what the fuck it really is. It's bullshit. And it's going to continue to be bullshit. When we got all the bullshit in the motherfucking world. When it comes to politics, when it comes to every motherfucking thing, it is always going to be bullshit. I'm sorry this video is long as fuck, but I'm just saying, this is a big topic, man. It's a big ass fucking topic, bro. But it's bullshit. People are just, people are fucking people. Our mind is so fucked off right now that we don't even understand that we can control our mind to do so many great fucking things. You know what I'm saying? What makes me and you different from motherfucking... Jay-Z and, and, and Burton and, and fucking Tom McDonald or Adam Calhoun or fucking Zero. What makes all of us different? Nothing. We're all fucking the same thing. We're all human beings. We're all the same shit. We all got the same hours in the day. We all got the same mind. Not the same mind frame, but we all have the same mind. We all have a brain, but not the same mind frame. We all don't think the like. If once we unlock this, like I've been learning, once we unlock our motherfucking brain, all this shit that we see in the world will fucking surpass us or bypass us or whatever. And we'll start looking in the world for what it really is. And then we'll start being able to fix shit and make a shift and make a move. But until we all are against each other, so what the fuck we're going to get? Want me to say this division of race is a in the face of America. Look at how far when it came. Oh, what a shame. How does the media fill us with hate? How do you feel like it's racist for someone to say that they're keeping America great? Let me speak. Great, great, great. I got something to say about the media. Let's talk about this white privilege. Let's talk about this white privilege. It don't exist. God is my witness. It does exist. But anyways, I got something to say about the media. Why are we not talking about all these fucking children that are getting goddamn kidnapped and shit? You know what I'm saying? Why are we not talking about the children getting sex trafficked and shit? Like, why, why, what's the really deal with that shit? Are you talking about white privileges and black lives and shit like that? Which, uh, I guess all this shit is goddamn, I guess, special fucking topic. But what's up with the children, man? Because our motherfucking children is our future. You know what I'm saying? We talk shit all about these little rappers and shit, but them our motherfucking future that we're raising. 
So how you think the world's gonna go? All the motherfucking elites and shit, they're gonna teach their kids to do the same shit they've been doing. Try to take over the world like pinky in the goddamn brain. You know what I'm saying? Pinky in the brain. But anyways, man, we have to understand that we have to start talking about what the real shit that really matters. These children and everything fucking matters, man. People who are getting killed matters. These stories matter, but we rather talk about what this person has on, or this chain, or this car, or this chick. It's stupid. It's dumb. Whether you want to believe it or not, there is such thing as a white privilege burden. You're not the same white dude that typically gets that privilege, buddy. I promise you, you're not. That's why you haven't got it. And maybe you have got it and you just don't believe that you got it Because I had to explain to the chick that I was saying That I was telling y'all about, you know what I'm saying That says, that hey, that she used to her advantage I had to explain to her like, hey, this is how shit really goes This is how you should look at things And she'd be like, oh yeah, you're right It is a white privilege, I didn't look at it like that Because there is a such thing as a fucking white privilege People God damn, sorry to yell at you guys but Fuck, I'm passionate about this shit why do we not believe that there really is a white privilege? Why do we not believe that black lives matter? Why do we not believe that all lives matter? Why do we not believe anything, you know what I'm saying? Because our minds, we don't want to think like the next person. We want to think for ourselves and just we want to think for the next person. Ain't that some bullshit when somebody thinks what you should do? How you should act? How you should say shit? How you should run your channel? People tell me all the time, yo, if you don't believe in this, you shouldn't do reactions. Nigga, just because I don't believe in what the fuck you believe in doesn't mean I shouldn't do reactions. Obviously, I should do reactions because people want me to do reactions. God damn it. They like what I say. They like what I do. Some people don't. Some people do. It's okay with me, though. There's a million. There's how many billion of people in this fucking world? And I'm only getting how many? 3,000 subscribers, which I do need y'all like subscribe. You know, it's been so long. But still, you know what I mean? Sorry the video's been so long, but God damn, this is a big-ass topic. I want to get into this more with my podcast. I want to do a podcast called Race to Earth. Yeah, Race to Race. Like face to face, but race to race, where we talk about all the race shit. So we could all come together one day and be one, guys. Me one. Shit, I love y'all, man. Shout out.